Hi there, welcome to Apple World Chris Brown turned 34, had a skating arena birthday celebration, and beat up Usher across the board last night. Goodness, and not to neglect, he actually performed with exactly the same attendant in that equivalent time period. Also, assuming that you feel like the tea is simply excessive, stand by till you hear what Usher needs to say regarding this. Did Chris Brown genuinely go after Usher? Also, where precisely is Diana Taylor in all of this? We should get down to the succulent subtleties as Usher talks about Chris Earthy pounding him. What was the deal? To praise his companion and individual hotshot, Usher tossed a big name-filled surprise birthday festivity for Wendy at Skate Rock City in Las Vegas. Furthermore, similar to each celeb party, it was starting off on a quite lit foot. Be it as it may, within a couple of hours, things gained out of influence really quickly. As first detailed by Hollywood opened, everything began when Chris Brown allegedly got impolite with artist and entertainer Tayana Taylor for an obscure explanation. Albeit different reports guarantee that Tayana had been overlooking Chris Brown. The hotspot for Hollywood opened made sense of the fact that Chris Brown was observably inebriated when he first moved toward Tayana. Furthermore, regardless of the best endeavors of a couple of visitors and even the host's attempt to intercede, things went south quicker than anybody might have, said C. Wendy. Temzi later got an onlooker's video wherein we can see Chris Brown, and he has all the earmarks of being shouting at Tayana, who was sitting before Usher stepped in, and that is when Chris went to outrage, dissatisfaction, or anything that was to introduce the middle of all the upheaval. Chris Brown purportedly called Usher a defeatist and left the arena. Be that as it may, the show was not a long way behind. Usher, supposedly attempting to settle things quickly, had pursued Chris Brown. What's more, that is when things truly went crazy in the parking garage, as hands were flying across the parcel. As per all the news that has emerged about this show, Chris Brown and his team supposedly bounced the unbelievable R&B vocalist. Furthermore, this beatdown was terrible, to the point that it evidently left Usher with a bloodied nose. Now that you're completely up to speed with what occurred, or if nothing else, its initial segment, it could likewise be useful to toss in that Chris Brown was certainly a raised spirits that evening since he had before posted on his Instagram story with the subtitle, I better get Cinco D this evening. What's more, when you blend liquor and a raving party together, the outcomes are rarely quiet. So while the subtleties of what genuinely went down after the contention in the arena have not been affirmed, it seems like Chris Brown was in a state of mind for whatever. However, that is not even the end of the show. Recall how we referenced that Chris Earthy's birthday slam was in Vegas? Indeed, the greater part of those celebs in attendance were likewise there for the Darlings and Companion celebration. What's more, this celebration was only hours away. So normally, when insight about the fight got out, individuals rushed to respond. As one individual said on Twitter, pause. So you're letting me know this all began on the grounds that Chris Brown slighted a lady, not Chris Brown. Every one of his fans let me know he had changed. Another person says he really wants assistance as opposed to having so many yes yes companions around. He wants to have somebody who thinks often about him and will let him know the genuine somebody in his team ought to have prevented the others from doing this or even attempted to de-raise what is going on. Tiana's significant other must be angry. And keeping in mind that this was all going down the battle and the purpose for it appeared to be nothing new. As one individual remarked, Chris Brown has a past filled with being. At the point when somebody brings it up, you all say the Rahana battle was such a long time ago, when he was a youngster. In any case, the realities are that he's had many examples of consistent conduct. In the event that this Usher circumstance is valid, it would make perfect sense. Furthermore, on the off chance that you want an update on what the Rahana battle was, the reason we can't confide in blustery at the point when Rihanna and Chris Earthy originally teamed up in 2005, Cupid was staying at work past 40 hours. They turned into a youthful and wonderful IT couple in 2008, yet things immediately went bad. Rihanna and Chris Brown were planned to perform at the 2009 Grammys, however, on the actual day of the occasion, it was reported that they would be missing. The media was quickly making a fool of itself to sort out why. What's more, it wasn't some time before the fact of the matter was uncovered, as they were leaving a pre-Grammy party the night prior to the occasion. The couple got into a battle and it was muddled. In a video cut from a narrative about his life, 
Chris Brown related the events of the evening. Rahana was incensed at him on the grounds that a lady from his past had messaged him and appeared in their area. He said she began going off. She said on the telephone, I can't stand you. Whatever, it makes no difference either way. She begins hitting me. We're in her little Lamborghini. You know, she's battling me. What's more, I'm like, look. The quarrel got exceptionally physical, with Rahana getting wounds all over. The following day, Chris Brown needed to report himself to the specialists. He was accused of a crime attack and condemned to five years of probation, one year of directing, and a half year of local area administration. Furthermore, this wasn't the last time Chris Brown got his name in the press for the most exceedingly terrible explanation conceivable. In 2020, an anonymous lady recorded a $20 million claim against the ERB vocalist got by Vulture, which charges he beat her on a yacht docked at a home possessed by Diddy on Star Island in Miami. Per the documentation, the lady is an artist, model, and artist who says Brown welcomed her to the yacht. Furthermore, this was unquestionably the most recent of the claims against Chris Brown, as the star has been portrayed as having an inclination for attack. The vocalist conceded to the crime attack on his ex, Rihanna, in 2009. He was captured in 2016 for supposedly compromising a lady with a weapon, although those charges were subsequently dropped. Earthy's ex, Karushe Tran, was granted a homegrown limiting request against the performer in 2017. In 2019, Brown was captured in Paris on a plane, and those charges were likewise later dropped. What's more, Brown, in the long run, sued the informant for maligning. However, this large number of charges doesn't appear to have impacted his remaining with individuals in his day-to-day -day existence. As one Twitter client made sense of, when Rahana and Chris Brown reunited momentarily and made music together, I genuine winced. However, at that point, I understood we have zero power over how individuals cycle and work through their injuries, and that is only reality. In 2015, Rihanna advised Vanity Fair that the choice to move past it was on the grounds that she was that young lady who felt that as much agony as this relationship is, perhaps certain individuals are fabricated more grounded than others. She proceeded, I was exceptionally defensive of him. I felt that individuals didn't figure him out. What's more, after the new battle with Usher, obviously she's not by any means the only one who will attempt to safeguard Chris Brown after a battle. In any case, brothers notwithstanding numerous sources and observers affirming that Chris Brown and Usher had gotten into a fight, it most certainly never really impacted the manly relationship between them. In addition to the fact that they still performed at the Sweetheart and Companion celebration as planned, it nearly seems like the attendant had likewise attempted to tell individuals that he was fine, as opposed to all the news going around. Usher jumped via web-based entertainment early Saturday morning in front of his set, and the video was adequately clear to show that he was okay and on her part. Tiana was recorded moving during Usher's presentation on Saturday. What's more, on the off chance that you're asking why that is news, indeed, she was getting down to Usher's front of a Chris earthy-colored melody. No doubt about it, it nearly seems as though fans were getting all warmed over nothing. Furthermore, the one point Chris Brown needs to make is pretty much that this isn't anything. After what the web has named Cycle 2 occurring on Saturday night between Chris Brown and the security at Darlings and Companions, Chris Brown went on Instagram and tended to it, saying, You all been geeked the entire end of the week. You all hauling it now. It was frantic. Individuals behind the stage and security were attempting to clear everybody off the stage. Individuals began pushing back. I mediated to tell them my kid was back there. What's more, we as a whole say honest, similar to all covers.